Many believe the Denver Nuggets' Jamal Murray to be a rising star, having already been to the playoffs twice and experienced Game 7 pressure four times. The Canadian has faced off against the best in the NBA, with some even comparing him to the likes of Steph Curry. In a recent interview, Jamal Murray explained why Steph Curry is the toughest player to guard in the NBA, along with his desire to be a great, not unlike Curry himself. G'day NBA fans, high five everyone and welcome back guys. If you're joining for the first time, welcome to Basketball Action. First up, Steph Curry, the toughest player to guard in the NBA. What time is it? Dead, dead, During the interview, Murray was asked who is the toughest player to guard in the NBA and chuckled before he responded by saying, Steph is really hard to guard. One, because he's short and two, because you don't know what he's going to do. Murray continued, explaining what makes Curry so difficult to guard. He said, You don't know if he's just going to pull it. You don't know if he's just going to end up going by you. If he's going to cross you over six times and then just shoot and look away. You absolutely have no clue what he's going to do. Murray said it's physically demanding to keep up, quipping. And I have to go with him. Murray then continued by revealing his main goal is to be the greatest, saying, I knew I was going to be here, but now my goal is to be the greatest. I want to be the best player in the world. That is my goal and my dream. Murray signed off by revealing he believes in himself and is motivated. I knew I've always had the talent, but to actually be here and actually have a chance at it, it gives me a lot of motivation, he said. Jay Crowder tweeted that he is struggling with the Heat's loss in the finals, posting last night that he had a Game 6 nightmare, is experiencing post-traumatic stress and feels sick. She'll be right, mate. Draymond Green believes that Andrew Wiggins could be like Kevin Durant on defense next season, thereby sending a warning to other championship contenders. According to Jason Quick of The Athletic, the only way he can see Carmelo Anthony returning to Portland is if Anthony has some kind of revelation and becomes a role player. Quick said he, quote, can't imagine that happening. According to Stephen A. Smith, Kawhi Leonard has urged the Clippers to land a point guard this offseason, saying, it's not that he wants to get rid of Patrick Beverly. He's a defense ace, but they need a point guard that can run a team and can shoot. According to reports, a Derrick Rose trade to the Lakers is a lot more likely to happen this offseason than it was during the trade deadline. The Lakers decided against a Rose trade last February because they predicted a strong buyout market and didn't want to force a trade. Who do you think is the best guard in the NBA today? Drop a comment guys, it's a pleasure as always. If you enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe and smash the like. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm, guys, and I really appreciate it. High five, everyone. Thanks for watching.